Hi, I'm Nate, and today with the help of some friends, we're going to show you a fast and easy way to cover your hoop houses in Overwinter Plus Film. To start, as usual, carefully cut open your rolls of poly. So we use the wrapper here to protect the corners, because it will uh, catch on these corners here since there's a the wiggle wire and some of the bottom cam sticking out. Be sure to check the path between your houses for any objects, loose fabric pins, etc., that might snag your poly as you roll it out. Next, having thrown ropes over the hoop house, the guys are tying knots to three points on the poly sheet. One on each end and one in the middle. In the middle here, pull it together. Something we can tie the rope around. Um, loop it around a few times, then the poly back down over, loop it again, we just do, just flip it over, make it so it's easy for them to get back off when it goes to do this. But with the wet bows, we do have to fluff it from this side, otherwise it sticks like glue. Once the knots are tied, the three-man team on the other side of the hoop house begin to pull while the poly is being fluffed from the sending side. This fluffing action keeps the poly from sticking to the morning dew that has condensed on the hoop house bows. And then once, once everybody's untied, we take four corners and we pull in opposite directions to make a nice straight line. What we do is we use one of these folds and we'll line it up so we got enough hanging over on either side. Once the first layer, in this case 2.5 mil overwinter plus film, is aligned, several securing bars are placed before the second layer is put on. The second layer, in this case used for insulation so the guys can grow all year round, is 3 mil overwinter plus. The 3 mil OW plus provides the strength to overcome the Indiana winters and is removed in spring leaving the 2.5 mil first layer to provide protection from the cold until removed in late May or June. This combination of 2.5 and 3 mil OW plus has replaced this grower's previous installation of two layers of 4 mil regular OW, saving them considerably in cost while still providing increased security from the weather. Once in place, the second layer is aligned and secured. Excess poly is cut from the sides and the ends are secured with a wiggle wire and channel as usual. Thanks for watching. I hope this video helps you in your installation and I'd especially like to thank the guys at Krugermatics for sharing their technique in covering hoop houses. If you'd like more information on our Overwinter Plus Polyline, call us today and talk to one of our friendly staff who'd be glad to answer any of your questions.